Welcome back everyone to Pontos Fathom Hobbies. This is Season 8, Episode 2 of Conan by Monolith, and we are playing a custom scenario called Conspiracy in Kauran that features the Conan crossbowmen. Uh, so we're here in the Tavern of the Thirsty Dog, Conan, Hydrathus, and Belit investigating the Captain of the Guard, who may be involved in treachery against... Queen Taramis. So as mercenaries, Conan and company are looking to collect the spell book uh, and bring it back as evidence of this, this keeps uh, potential conspiracy uh, to have treacherous uh, results and also to get paid. So uh, in, in, in the spirit of Conan's mercenaries, quick shout out to sponsors, Pulse's Fathom Press, Three volume disclosure from the Necronomicon fragment. Check out the bookstore links below. Uh, we're talking about how Lovecraft and Cthulhu has a great match together. I'm thinking of doing a mashup between Conan games and maybe something like Cthulhu Wars. What do you guys think about that? Leave a comment below. We also have a Patreon. If you're uh, interested in supporting us, by all means, Patreon is a great way to do it. Uh, we appreciate it. But also, just being here as a support, watching our videos through the end. Uh, Liking, subscribing, commenting, sharing, uh, all of that. Uh, comments, I'd like to have a conversation down below. If you have something interesting you want to say, if you've played a game of Conan, you want to share a link. If you've got minis to show off, I love mini painting. So use the comments for us to uh, start our dialogue. And as we get up to 1,000 uh, subscribers, start going to live streams if you guys are interested in that kind of stuff. So uh, let's get it out to some other people and jump into turn number two. So I will clear out these two Bostonian guards uh, that were killed in the last round. We got a turn counter on one. I'm going to move Conan's one injury across and we'll dredge these down. And then we'll also heal um, uh, recovery so we can move. Okay, so let's jump into round two. Uh, Conan still faced off with this guard. But I think we'll have Belit uh, go ahead and move uh, one, two, three to face off with this crossbowman. Clear him out. And we'll have Hydrathus come in and he can um, also prep for his lightning storm and it's three gems try to c cancel that guy out through the roll. so he's going to get line of sight through this he's got this crossbowman here so let's go ahead and uh, start the action here we'll start out with Conan Conan against the guard Let's give Conan a gem in the attack. Uh, he gets two dice for his attack. So one for his Conan sword augmented with his, and this looks like a good roll also. So the Bostonian guards have two. Uh, Bostonian guards have two hit points armor plus one hit point. So Conan slays this Bosonian guard. Uh, next up is Belit. With her ornamental spear, she will also place a gem in her attack, giving her two to roll. And that's three as well. Uh, Bos uh, Archerman, they've got three hit points though. So, so her attack for him, she does, uh, let's give her one more attack die because Okay, so now she's got uh, Bosonian, the crossbowmen have one armor plus three hit points, so this one is two, three, four, so she's able to take this crossbowman out as well. And then finally, it's Hydrathus against, Hydrathus against the crossbowman with the lightning strike uh, he will roll that as well 
two. Okay, so uh, two is one damage is taken by that crossbowman, so we'll just indicate that one damage on his card. This crossbowman has got one out of the three. And, and that's going to do it. So let's move these out. Uh, we'll play for our overlord turn now. And uh, next up for the overlord would be overlord card. Also, they can dredge their pieces here. Uh, we get uh, a leader and one. So we've got the captain, which is both. So it's basically the captain activates. Let's have him activate, and, and because he's in this lead position with ranged weapons, he'll also activate these two uh, crossbowmen. So, uh, so they will take uh, activations... Captain is one, and crossbowman is two. So that'll be a total of three to activate them. And I guess the captain is activated first, so we'll put him in the sixth position. And that'll be a total of three for activation. And then one for the movement. So they will go, um, captain of the guard can move three, one, two, uh, three, one, two, Three, one, two, three. Right, so uh, they're all right around this corner. Captain of the Guard can face Conan. They can both do attacks one to Billet, one to Hydrathus, and one to Conan. This guy is also activated uh, as a crossbowman that's active. So Captain of the Guard goes against Conan. He's got eight hit points. So again, let's indicate him with his eight hit points right on his card. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. And we'll just take those out as he loses them. And we'll do the same thing for the crossbowman. We'll make it negative. So as he takes uh, hits, we'll re remove those. Okay, so first up is crossbowman. He's got uh, an attack with a red and an orange. He does one. Conan gets a roll right out of the gate with his armor. And he blocks his attack. So first attack by the captain of the guard. Conan's uh, chainmail blocks it. Crossbowman one's going to fire at Billet. Try to shoot her in the back there. Uh, crossbowman does... Uh, a single air, a single red die for attack. He misses. Second crossbowman will also try to attack Billet, I guess, because she's there. Uh, he does one damage. Billet does have leather armor. She gets to roll the yellow die in defense, and she misses. Um, well, it's worth it to give her a reroll. So let's give her one reroll, and she can reroll that die. And she still misses. So she takes one one uh, hit. And then finally, last crossbowman firing here to Hydrathus. Again, he gets a roll. It's one damage. Hydrathus has a shield, which is orange. And he blocks arrow lodged into Hydrathus's shield. So no damage is taken. Uh, so at the end of the round... Um, um, archers have been uh, crossbowmen have come out uh, the keep is not fully alerted yet so s people are still back in their rooms captain of the guard faced off against Conan Hydrathus is in, in this crossbowman basically having a line of sight battle through the doorway so it's definitely at a, uh, a disadvantage there. Belit just f finished off one of the crossbowmen, only to have two come up behind her. So she's going to have to come up with a strategy next round. We'll move the indicator across to uh, turn number three. And we will see you guys in the next, next turn. So uh, I think what our strategy would be is maybe Belit will beeline it for this chest to try to get that spell book or to, term, to determine at least which chest the spell book's in. And maybe Hydrathus can come up and spend some time chasing after the, uh, the second one. So uh, 
that's going to do it. We'll see you guys in turn number three. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.